Hi there you guys, I'm Teddy from Bijutel Beading and in today's video I'm gonna be showing you how to make these colorful seed bead earrings. So if you want to support me and see more and more videos like this, it's a good idea to subscribe if you still haven't and hit that bell button to be notified for my new absolutely free upcoming videos. You could also like, share and comment and you don't know how much you help me only with this action and I'll answer to all of your questions down there in the comments and if you make beautiful jewelries following my tutorials please share them on my facebook page that i posted below i will be so happy to see your creations you could also check my new merch store where you could find max t-shirts hoodies pillows phone covers and so many other stuff in the designs are made especially from me for you and when you buy stuff from there you support me my channel and my mission and the stuff there are great present for your bidding friends or for yourself this is a way to express yourself better and you could find links down there in description and here at the eye icon but let me stop talking and start with the list of the materials okay guys and for this video what you're going to use are four colors of 11 oz beads and you could use 10 oz beads if you don't have 11 oz but all of them should be in one size and i'm using here ear wires monofilament that is 0 0.006 inches or 0 0.15 millimeters you could use other beading thread of your choice i squeeze my monofilament with these flat nose pliers to go through size 10 beading needle and of course i'm using scissors and now i'm going to take about half an arm span of thread on my needle and i'll be back Okay guys, and I'm back and I'm going to take six of these beautiful black beads. Okay, I have my six. And I'm going to slide them down. I will stick my needle in my mat and here I want to make a knot. making a loop and going twice through the loop I've made and pulling okay and I'm going through the following seed bead now I have a circle of six beads and I will take one more black bead and as I'm exiting from one of my blacks I'm going through the following and pulling taking one more going through the following okay just like that one more pull one more okay One more. And here I will add my last one. Okay. And when I pull, this is what I have. Now I'm going to exit through one of my newly added black ones and go in the next row. And now what I need are three red beads, okay? And I'm going through the following black bead that's sticking out. Then I need three more. Going through the following that's sticking out. Three. Okay, now I have this and I will go through these two red beads and I will take two yellows, one green and then again two yellows and as I'm exiting from this green I'm going through the following, uh, sorry, from this red I'm going through the following red that's sticking out 
then I'm taking again two yellows one green and two yellows and I'm going to the following red that's sticking out okay and I'm going to continue this until the end of this row pause this video and I'll meet you here okay guys and when I continue beading adding the same uh, combination of beads here I am and I'm finishing this row and then I want to go through these three beads don't worry your work bands like this we'll fix it later okay then what I need are two reds one black and then again two red beads this is what I have on my needle and as I'm exiting from this green I'm going through the following green then again two red beads one black and two reds this is what I have and I'm going through the following green one in the same way I will finish it up to here and I'll be back to tell you what's coming up next okay and when you pause this video and you're up to here we will continue together okay so now what I want to do is exit out of this black one and here I need three black beads like this and I'm going back in circle through this black one and I want to exit out of the green one if you can do this in one movement if you cannot just do this by going through the next C bead and then one more time to reach the green one okay then I need three green beads and I'm going back in circle through this green and pulling and my goal is to exit out of the black one and then I need three black ones okay like that and I'm going back through this black one in circle you see I have a loop of beads here and I'm pulling then I need three green beads and I'm going back in circle through this green here and I'm exiting out of the next black and I will show you one more time three blacks going back in circle through the black one now guys pause this video do this until here and I'll be back to tell you what's coming up next okay guys and I'm up to here where I'm adding my last three green beads and what I want to do is exit here out of this first black right angle weave that I made okay I'm exiting out of here and now I will show you how to add your ear wire so I'm taking my ear wire taking just one seed bead going here through the ear wire taking one more seed bead after the ear wire and I'm going back in circle through this one okay okay when I pull I have this and what I want to do is go around in circle reinforcing this part here okay reinforce it as many times as you want until you feel your work is secure and then you could go down here and make a knot somewhere between two beads okay let's say here and I'm making my knot by making a loop and going once and going second time through the loop I made and I'm pulling and then you could repeat this several more times and when you make it a few more times you go through the following C bead and you cut your thread and your earring will be ready 
Okay guys, and when I repeat all of those steps one more time, this is what I have. I have a beautiful pair of seed bead earrings. So if you like what I'm showing you here, it's a good idea to subscribe and hit that bell button to be notified for my new absolutely free upcoming videos. And if you want to support me, you could like, share and comment and you don't know how much you help me on with this action. And I will answer to all of your questions in the comments. And um, you could also share your beautiful creations that you did following my tutorials uh, uh, down there on my Facebook page that I posted below this video. And um, you could also check my new merch store where you could find uh, mugs, pillows, hoodies, t-shirts, phone covers and the designs are made especially from me for you. They are a great present for you or for your bidding friends. And in this way, when you buy stuff from there, you support me, my channel and my mission and you could find links down there in description and here at the icon. Thank you so much for watching. Bye bye from me.